Hey guys, welcome to another video. Uh, in this video, uh, my wife is cooking and she's making uh, Beacol Express, which is one of my favourites. So we'll go quickly over the ingredients first. Okay, honey, take it away. <laughs> the pork belly. Pork belly, and we got this from the supermarket. Aye. Okay. And coconut milk. Fresh coconut milk. Chili. Now, Green these, chili. Are, these are special type of chili chilies. Aye. This is small chili. We call it chili labrillo. Uh huh. And what about the big ones? What are they called? Just chilies. Huh? <laughs> I don't know. Just chilies? I think. And small chili. So the small chilies are, are these like bird, bird dye, yeah. bird dye. And yeah. garlic, onion, and the secret ingredient. What's that, can I see? The shrimp paste. Shrimp paste? Aye. That's it. Ah, okay. And that's it? Yes, easy. Are we not having rice? <laughs> oh, we don't have rice. Okay. All right. Okay. So first things we do. Uh, first thing we do is chop the chilies. So they're quite chunky, actually. These chilies, aren't they? I mean, you're not. Um, you know, normally when I make a curry, the chilies would be cut up quite small, but these are chunky. But these ones are not as spicy, right? No, no. That's why I add this red chili. Ah, the red chilies to give it some extra spice. Right. Aye. So yeah, this is one of my favourite Filipino dishes. Um, I mentioned that in the last video um, when we did a uh, like a how how we how we met and how well we know each other. So one of my favourite foods is Bicol Express, and the first time I had it was in Malaysia. When we lived in Malaysia. What is this? Is the onion? onion. It's just a red onion. Aye. So you only put one. Aye, so enough. one red onion. How many chilies? Uh, the green ones? I put seven, I think. Seven? Okay. I think more, it's not spicy. But you said the red ones are spicy. It is. Okay. And what's the procedure then for? What's the first thing you do once everything's chopped up? The pork belly, you have to put salt and pepper. Uh huh. And then put it in a pan. Okay, so we've got a big, uh, big pan here. I will put it from the ground, but I'm not going to put oil in it. You're not going to put oil? No. Okay. So the garlic, uh, how many garlic cloves? Just four. Huh? Four, maybe. Four. Oh, you're sweating here already. And I'm not doing it. It's very hot in this kitchen. We've got, we've got like a fan here, uh, but it doesn't do much. We don't have any aircon in the kitchen. So, uh, it's pretty hot. So I'm smashing. Smashing the garlic and then peeling. Okay, this is the easy way to um, to basically peel the garlic. Smash it with a flat knife like that. And how long does it take to prepare and cook? Maybe 30. Uh, 30 minutes? Aye. Total? Yes, Okay, so 30 minutes, it's not too bad. And when do you put in the fish sauce? Fish paste, shrimp paste. Shrimp paste. So first, you have to put a little bit of oil in the pan, then garlic, onion. Okay, so these, these get fried in the pan first. And then? Pork belly. Pork belly, so you put that in the same time? I mean the same pan? Okay, so a wee bit of salt, huh? Turn it on. Okay, that's on. Uh, so she said it takes about 30 minutes from start to finish. This video will not be 30 minutes long, I can assure you. <laughs> I thought you were doing the garlic in that first. 
Oh, you're make, doing the pork first. This is my make it <laughs> to make it a bit crispy. Ah, okay. So straight into the uh, the pan goes the pork belly, mm. and then you're going to take that out and put the onions and the garlic and chili, yeah. and then put it back in later. How long do you fry this? Until it's golden brown. Until it's golden brown, okay. And can you remember how much it cost? How much is the pork belly? How many pieces of pork belly? Five. So Five pieces. Only half a kilo. 175 pesos. Okay. 175 pesos. Um, okay. Per kilo? No, half. Ah, oh, for half a kilo. Um, okay. So five pieces of pork belly was pork belly was half a kilo. Yes. Okay. So pretty cheap for a bit of coconut milk. How much does that cost? Twenty pesos. Twenty. <laughs> Twenty pesos. Okay, and the chilies they were. I think chilies were about sixty-five pesos or sixty-eight pesos. We bought them in um, SM Supermarket, that's right. Uh, there was just a bundle of about, I can't remember what that was, the bundle there. Mm -hmm. I've still got the price on it. 63 pesos. When you cook from home, you can do it very cheaply. Uh, it's just, uh, you know, being in the, in the Philippines in this kitchen, it's very hot. You probably see the sweat's running down my head. <laughs> Already. Okay, so this this won't take what more than ten minutes. Is that? Five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes on each side. So as you can see, that's starting to crisp up and go brown. Another few minutes, and that will be taken out, and then we'll put in the uh, the onion, chili, and garlic. So these are going to be. Uh, chopped up into smaller pieces, she just kept them like that and now to, um, to put them in to get them crisped up. This is the shrimp paste, bagoong, guinea sang bagoong, and yes it does stink. <laughs> Wait, <does> it? <laughs> well it does. It's a secret recipe. I know it's a secret recipe but it still stinks. I mean, when I say stinks, I mean like in a fishy way. <laughs> Cut the meat with scissors. Aye. <laughs> <laughs> Why oh. don't you use a knife? This is the easy way, honey. Is it? Oh, That's the see. easy way, alright. Okay. Uh... Unless there's bone in it, then you can't cut through bone. Garlic first. Mm, and how long will you fry this for? Just five minutes? Yeah. Most good now. Uh, and the red onion. Shrimp paste. Much. How much? One big big. That's a big. Thank you, That's enough. Maybe a bit more. For luck. Okay then, mix it all up. I can smell the shrimp paste now. Stinks. <laughs> oh, it's strong. But it adds to the flavour. Coconut milk next. I'm not going to put them on just a bit. You're not putting all the coconut milk? Mm -hmm. How much is it anyway? It's looks about three quarters of a pint. Maybe. Half a pint. Wee bit of pepper. It's just black pepper. Uh, yeah, it's right there. Okay. That looks nice. Do you know how much coconut milk that is? I think it's two cups. Two cups? So we just leave this now for maybe four to five minutes, stir it a few times, and then serve it with the rice, correct? Aye. Okay. So in the meantime, 
Once this is done, we're going to go for a quick shower and then we'll serve it up. Okay, we're showered and feeling a bit cooler. Can't beat a cold shower in the Philippines. So, this is ready now. The rice is ready and the Beacon Express is ready. Looks good. Okay, so this is the Beacon Express. We've got rice. Let's give it a go. See how spicy it is. You want to go first? I'm the guinea pig. Let's try it. Mm. Huh? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. There's a wee kick to that. Spicy. Hiya. It's nice. You can't be home cooking. Okay guys, catch you in the next one. Hope you enjoyed. Cheers.